channel. Welcome to Unveiling the Sacred with your host, Mr. Jacob Noel. I hope you are doing just fantastic. For real though, I hope you're doing good today. It's good to, uh, it's good to be here. A little, uh, a little refresher, a little reminder for your soul. Just wanted to holler at you and say, never miss an opportunity to slow down. Slow down. A lot of our problems we cause ourselves, And have you ever noticed that when you're in a rush sometimes, when you're trying to do something fast, when you're trying to get done with that, you end up making mistakes and you ironically it takes longer to do something whereas if you're slow steady you know slow and steady then you're more focused but when you're rushing 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 it's like you mess up and you end up taking longer and there's some wisdom in that lesson which is Life isn't meant to be rushed through. And I really think it's important to slow down and, and to see that life is only ever this moment. This moment is beyond time. It's all that there is. It's, it's always going to be this moment, no matter if it's 4.47 a.m., 4.52 p.m., 12.21 a.m. <laughs> Whenever that moment comes, whenever Thursday at 3 p.m. comes and it finally arrives, it will be this moment still. So if you think about it, every moment in your life, no matter what moment, whatever, any moment that you can experience will always be right now. Tomorrow, when you're, when you're somewhere at four o'clock, I'll be like, yo, what time is it? And, and it'll still be right now because right now is the only time you can experience life. You know, right now is the only thing that's real. Everything else is just in your head, really. Um, and so with that being said, we really got to take our life back into our own hands and realize that time is an illusion in the sense that the only thing that's real is right now. Let's focus on what's real. You know, the future and the past. It's an illusion in the sense that you can't grab it. You can't experience it. It's just, it's, it's, it's in your head. And that's not to say it's not important to plan or to remember. All I'm saying is to remember that the true importance is right now. And that's the message that you hear a lot, but you hear it a lot for a reason. If you want to create a better future, if, if you want to get somewhere in your life, what matters most is what you do right now. It's the only time or place that you can make action ever. No matter where you are, no matter what time it is, it'll all be here and now, you know? So this is where my power is in this moment. And when we're constantly rushing to the next moment, we're missing out on all the amazing things around us. Somewhere along the way, it feels that we have bought in, we've bought in, bought in to the idea that tomorrow will be better or the future holds peace or, you know, working towards that moment when it'll finally be okay. And it's like, if you think about it, it really, it's always, Tomorrow really is always there because it never really comes. The only day you have is today. The only time or place you can experience the beauty in life is right now. And I'm afraid that we're missing our life by rushing, running through it, you know? Because we want to be productive, because we want to achieve, etc. But if we don't know how to slow down and enjoy and appreciate and experience, this here we're gonna miss our life because this is it right now this is the only thing that's real and that's something that I have to keep coming back to and I will 
be working on for my entire life. You know, my friend asked, we were talking about what does it mean to waste your life? And, you know, I, you could do anything with your life and then always kind of say, I could have done it differently. You know, there's a million different ways that you could live. And you could always say, man, I could have done it differently. You know, no matter what you choose. But, you know, to me, I think the only truly, true way to waste your life, it's not making mistakes, you know? A lot of people say, you know, they only regret the mistakes and ch chances they didn't take, not the, not the mistakes that they made. <sighs> the only way I see that you can waste your life here on earth in this body is to not be present for it. You know, to always be focused on some imaginary future, to always be dwelling in the past. To always be focusing on some imaginary future or dwelling in the past is, is disempowering because your power is here. Your power to create, your power to, you know, reflect, to plan, to act, act. Your, <laughs> your power to act, your, your human potential, it's all here, you know? So we gotta focus on what's real, which is this moment. You heard me say that a few times by now. But, you know, I just, I'm recognizing as I grow up the importance of truly just sinking in, slowing down, living at my pace. Like I need to run. We don't think there's enough for us, you know? We, we think that someone else is gonna get there before us and take what's ours and take what's meant for us. But truly, that's not trusting life, you know? Truly trusting life is saying, you know, I can live in my perfect time and what's meant for me will be for me, you know? Nobody else in this world can take or stop you from truly acquiring or experiencing what's truly meant for you. Nobody else can get in the way of that. So knowing that, man, it's not a rat race. We don't have to race, 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 race through our life. Learn to slow down and trust that life is not a race. You are here now. You made it. We've arrived. Like, now all that's left to do is truly experience it. It's not gonna get better in 10 years, you know? I mean, hopefully it will, but to live your life, let's see. To live your life for the future and not for the moment, you could live to be a million, and if you're all, you know, or whatever, whatever you could live to be a thousand years old and to live your life for the future for those thousand years would be to miss the point the whole time because you're missing your life man like Eckhart Tolle says it's like most of us we view the present moment as some kind of obstacle to getting to the future so we overlook the present moment which is all there ever is and we we kind of see it as something we need to get through to get to there, you know, to get to that moment. But it's like, once you get to that moment, are you able to live in that moment? Right? Or are you just worrying about where's the next moment? And that's how your life progresses, man. You know, getting to a destination, but then do you ever experience the destination? You know? One more quote. Alan Watts. Sure, you might have heard of him. Oh, he said, planning for the future is only valuable to someone who can live in the present. So make your plans for next Thursday with your friends at 5 p.m. But once, you know, once it's finally next Thursday at 5 p.m., you better be able to drop your other plans of the future and truly live in the moment. You know, if you get to that time and it becomes now, 
and you're now you start to like think about the future again we're, 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 we're perpetually doing this man and if we're we don't learn how to live in the moment we're not gonna live a satisfied life you know it's never gonna be enough so we got to learn to slow down man. and we can only do that with intention you got to make the time to slow down the world isn't gonna give you this time you got to make and take the time this is your life word up this is something that I know for a fact is like a central theme and a central issue of humanity man like we're, we're really obsessed with the future but we got to remember that we are creating the future with what we do now we're creating the future with our actions now we're also creating the past if you think about it everything is right now so what you're doing now is going to become the past, but it's also helping to, you know, create the step for what will come in the future. So it's like, it literally is the message is now this moment is, 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 is what it is. It's all about it. So I'm here to just, you know, do my part to remind the people who are willing to listen. And uh, we're all students to life. So be blessed, beautiful ones. And spread some love out there. I hope this resonated with you. Much love.